best podcast in Long Beach, California. This is Tacos and Workouts. What it is, what it is. Podcast. Yo, what it is, what it is. With the best podcast in Long Beach, California. Two boy tacos and workouts. Hey, we made it out again. That's right. Another talk opportunity right here, right in my own backyard. You know, uh, we're going to stop by at, uh, you know, the Taqueria brand. That's right. The Taqueria brand. At least I, I think that's how you say it. Let's double check. And yes, yes, I was right. It's called the, the Taqueria brand. Right? This one's in the city of Long Beach. And we decided to uh, give those tacos a, uh, a chance. See what they're all about. Let's check it out. It's that time again, we're gonna tear up this taco review for another workout. Let's go get it. Alright guys, look man, working out is hard, it's not easy, um, you know what, doing some minutes is it's better than doing no minutes, and what I mean is if you only have 5 minutes to work out, if you only have 10 minutes, 15, 20, 30 minutes to work out, I recommend you do so. So remember, at the end of the day, some minutes is better than no minutes, work out to the best of your ability, let's get back to that taco review. All right, guys, it's time to talk about tacos. Look, this, this is this is the deal right here. I've seen this spot, and I decided to stop by and give it a shot, right? I was quite impressed with the patio outside. I walked in. You know what? I was impressed that they have aguas frescas. I looked at the menu. They had quite a selection. I think I'm going to come back and try uh, their birria uh, plate. That looked appealing. But you know what? This is a taco channel, and we decided to try the tacos, man. They had some birria tacos, which I was thinking about getting, but I, I went with the street tacos, the Tijuana style street, the street tacos, right? And uh, it was 15 bucks for three tacos. That's right, 15 bucks for three tacos. And uh, we went to town on those tacos, and you know what? It had beans inside of it. I don't ever recall having a street taco that had beans in it, but this place does. That you're either a fan for that or not. Me, myself, I'd rather not have beans on my Tijuana style street tacos. But we had their tacos. Look, man, their habanero sauce was. Uh, Tasted a little cheesy to me, but it had quite a kick. It was it was really strong. If you like that, you know uh, the guacamole was good, right? And overall, the tacos were okay. Um, but this place has has a, a lot of potential. I see what they're doing with this place. I see why people might come and, and enjoy this specific spot. Some of the comments that I got from other some other the patrons was that they're a little too on the pricey side. Hey, but you know what? Taco prices have gone up. 
So uh, that's something to watch out for. Uh, are we gonna be coming back to this place? Oh yes, son. Yes, yes indeed. Because ha there's uh, other things on the items that we want to try out. Now, the moment of truth. How are we gonna rate this spot? We're gonna have to give them a two out of five. That's right, a two out of five tacos. It's a good spot, it's a little on the pricey side, uh, but they still have some things on the menu we wanna try out, so we will be coming back. All right, guys, that's it for this episode. Do me a huge, huge favor. Um, if you want honest taco reviews, right? Because a lot of these other foodies, they don't give you the right stuff. That's not what my channel's all about. Look, I'm not gonna lie to you, steer you wrong, and take you places where you don't wanna go and then say, JR, you lied to me, those tacos weren't great. No, no, no. OG taco reviews, tacos and workouts, doing how it needs to be done. Do me a huge favor, subscribe to the channel, and uh, share the content. And until then, we'll see you guys next time.